Hey everybody, Mark Back to Comics and I'm back. This time I'm going to be opening up a 2022 Leaf Draft Football card box. If you're interested in seeing what's inside, stay tuned for that intro. Alright, so welcome back. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so when I do put out some content, you get in a timely fashion. Like I said, I got a 2022 uh, Leaf Draft Unboxing Football Pack. Um, from what I went, I went to uh, Target the other day. I had to do some errands. And then I uh, dropped by the uh, card section um, and ended up seeing what they had there. And I noticed that they had a few different packs there that were very similar. They had a blue and a green, I think it was. And I saw this gold. Um, was pretty enamored by the uh, look of the box set on there. It came with two autographs plus a medal. So there's only three cards in the pack. So this is going to be a rather quick unboxing. Um, looked up some of the videos online and there were some decent cards in there. This is, I believe, an unlicensed pack um, from what I gathered from watching different videos. But um, what I saw is you can get quite the variety of um, draft signed cards on here and it can be anyone from the entire draft class so <laughs> there could be some cards in here that are players I've never heard of um, but I, I also got uh, I was pretty interested because it came with one metal card like a, it could be a metal prism it could be w whatever and uh, that that sounded pretty interesting the pack itself was 2250 so it is a little bit of a pricey pack. I did compare it to other packs there, like I said, the blue, and I think it was the green or purple, something like that. And they were pretty similar in price, and you get more cards. But from what I gathered, they were like base cards, and I kind of wanted to, you know, focus on just the signatures. So, you know, less cards for me, um, which is good. And, um, you know, if I get something nice, and then it's even better. So uh, I'm going to open this up. Enjoying a little bit of whiskey today. Uh, this was one of my uh, gifts I got for my birthday. This was uh, Sap 56, Maple Flavored Whiskey. This is from, uh, uh, looks like upstate New York. So it's pretty good. So uh, I'm going to enjoy that with this card unboxing. So let's take a look at this. Let me know too in the comments below if you guys have uh, previously opened up one of these packs and um, these boxes and and uh, it, if you thought it was worth it for you. So, uh, open this up. This is what it looks like inside. So it is, you know, pretty protected. And what I do see in here, there are some, um, you know, sleeves and protectors for the cards, which I do like. Uh, saves me from uh, getting, you know, some sleeves for the, for the cards itself, which is nice. I know in the comic, and uh, when we do unboxings in uh, mystery boxes for the, you know, on our comic channels, we obviously prefer that our comics are bag and boarded. So I, I would assume that you guys also prefer your uh, cards and sleeves with uh, penny sleeves, the top loaders. So um, let's take a look at these cards. I'm going to show off the uh, I'm going to show off the signed cards first, and then I'll show off the metal, and uh, then I'll pause. I'll you know if it's a draft. You know, rookie that I'm not familiar with, I'll have to look it up and see what team they play for and so forth. So, first card. There we go. Oh, we got a quarterback. All right. Um, so, we got Chris Aludkin. Oh, I'm definitely butchering this. Chris Aludkin. He is, um, it says quarterback, 6'2", 195. Show you the back of the card. That's what it looks like. Um, not familiar with this uh, quarterback. And um, looking at the uni, I'm not really. That's I don't know if that's Oregon. That doesn't look like Oregon. It's pretty close to Oregon. I don't know. I'll have to look this up. I'm not sure. Um, oh, the next card. I am definitely familiar with the team because I am a fan of this team. This is my team for college. This is uh, from the University of Michigan. This is Daxton Hill. This is really neat. He's, um, let me see, defensive back. I forget if he was, if he was a, a corner or if he was a safety. 
But uh, that's really neat. Just get that reflection out of the way. So I've got a quarterback and a defensive end, a defensive back, not a not defensive end. Um, gonna have to look these players up because I'm not sure if, um, if they were drafted or not. And uh, all right, so for the metal, oh, this is pretty neat. We got look at that shininess right there. We got an Isaiah Spiller. He was, uh, if you're not familiar with Isaiah Spiller, he was a running back for Texas A&M. Um, there's a little bit of information here in the back. The cards, the, the metal, like I said, is what, what really interested me in, in these boxes were the, uh, the two signatures and the metal because they looked really neat from the videos on, uh, when I saw them on YouTube. Uh, gives you a little bit of information. He was um, started 9 of the 13 games as a true freshman. It's 946 yards and 10 touchdowns. Got him freshman All-SEC. He started in the 2020 and was named first team All-SEC. His father, Fred, was also an Aggie. So that's really cool. All right, so I'm going to pause this real quick and look these up to see if they're playing for any NFL teams or if they just went undrafted. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. So I had to do a little bit of research because um, I wasn't familiar with uh, a couple of the players. So I had to look this one up. This was uh, Chris Lodekin. So apparently, this is South Dakota State University. I uh, was not familiar with that uniform. But uh, he was drafted in the seventh round by uh, Pittsburgh. And then <laughs> to find out, he was actually one of the second round of cuts. So now he's on the uh, roster for the Kansas City Chiefs. Obviously, he's not playing. Uh, <laughs> but uh, this is pretty cool. Um, and I looked these up. Some of, you know, these weren't selling for much. I think this was like $2, $3. Uh, the next one was, so this one I was familiar with. This was um, Isaiah Spiller. So he is actually on the roster for the Los Angeles Chargers. He was uh, drafted in the fourth round, uh, 123rd pick. So this was cool. I really like this. This is a cool looking card. Uh, when I looked this up, this was right around a $5 card. Um, and then the last card, as a University of Michigan fan, I saved this one for last. This is Daxon Hill. He was actually drafted in the first round by the Cincinnati Bengals at pick number 31. He is the, he plays safety. Um, he's not the starter, but he, I think he has played a game when I looked it up. But uh, this was pretty cool, also a few dollars. So um, after reviewing the, the box itself, um, I do like the prospect of getting two signs, uh, two signed cards and a medal uh, for your chance of getting somebody, you know, well known. Um, but you really have to hit some of the top players for you to Get your money's worth after tallying up the three cards i maybe got like i don't know 10 12 bucks out of these cards so uh, definitely not worth it when you're paying 22 bucks for the box but it was definitely a pretty fun unboxing uh to get these you know three cards so let me know down in the comments down below what you guys thought um have you guys opened up one of these boxes um or if not what you guys thought about the cards would you think these are cool looking cards so uh that's it for this time until next time marks with the comics